What's up you guys and welcome back to the channel. So here we are playing more Farming Simulator 19 and as you can see we are picking up where we left off last time which is returning to find that the workers left this field kind of unfinished and unfortunately they've knocked over our vintage truck as well. So the first thing I'm going to do is just jump straight in here and if you enjoy this video please do subscribe to the channel and I'd love it if you'd leave me a like as well as that would mean a great deal to this channel. But what I want to do is show you just straight off the bat here how to flip this truck back over because you could try all sorts of techniques as I have in the past like grabbing a tractor and trying to push it over and I don't know all sorts of different things that you can try to get this vehicle back on its feet. What we want to do actually though guys is just to go into the menu, press the menu button and then you're going to cycle along and you're going to go to the uh, map screen. You then use the right stick to move around here and we're going to place the cursor on the actual vehicle that we've got flipped over so yeah that's our fiat which is between uh, field 29 and 21 so what you want to do is just um, click down on the right stick to select the vehicle and as you can see it comes up there and then what we're going to do is reset it by hitting y and it's going to ask us if we do want to do that and we just hit yes so what's now happened is the vehicle has disappeared completely off the face of the earth no i'm just joking well, I thought it was going to return the vehicle to the shop. It's returned it to our farm. I should have read that correctly. That's my bad. But anyway, here we go. So we've got our vehicle back, which is quite nice. Um, we'll bring it back out. Why not? We haven't really used it as of so far. I mean, it cost us to get it. Um, and obviously, we're trying to do things on a budget. But, on, you know, unfortunately, guys, we haven't really had a chance to use it as of yet. Um, I'm sure we will get chance as time goes on. What I'll do is I'll just reverse it back in here for now and it can park up and kind of look pretty for us. So what we'll do next is just head out to these fields which are the two ones that we've got available to us at the moment to work on. Um, the two that we purchased in the first episode. Now as you can see the AI here has not finished this job and I don't know why that is. I've never seen that before. Um, and we also have this field to work on as well. As you can see, it's quite a large field, this one. But there is wheat growing here. Um, it is currently growing. It's 100% fertilized. There's no weeds. And it does require lime, though. So it might be an option for us to throw down some of that. Um, but for now, that's growing. Um, what we're going to do here, guys, is we are going to tidy this up. As you can see, there is some... It is partly fertilized as we go along to different degrees. Um, there's potatoes growing in this particular section right now. And as you can see, well, if we move over here, there's nothing growing. It's just 100% fertilized. So what we'll do is, let's see if we can tidy this up. Let's see if we can get this sorted. Because the AI obviously has left and, and hasn't been bothered. Right, let's take a look then. So we'll... If the problem is, is it, it's, we're going to have to really get it stuck in here. And uh, what we'll do is we'll just lower this and see if we can deal with it. I think it's going to make a bit of a mess of the field if we try to um, tackle it sideways on. I wonder what would happen if we went along it sideways. I think it would make a complete mess of it. So this may take some time to sort out actually now. I think what I'll do is I will attempt a sideways thing here. Um, it could be a really bad idea because obviously I think we'd normally have to plant sideways. We might just end up with part of the field where we actually, when we actually come to put the seed down, we might end up with part of the field that isn't um, growing properly. I've never done this before. We'll give it a go. I think it's a poor choice this, but... Um, tackling it and moving all the way along a tiny bit at a time and ploughing in that way would have took a long time and for the additional sort of um, yield that that will produce it's kind of pointless really um, so we'll give this a whirl and see how we get on as you can see our case is making light work of this so decent tractor this one I might pick up another one of these tractors um, 
Although I would like to get a John Deere as well on this farm, so we'll see. Yeah, this is this is really poor, this. It's a really very poor idea. In fact, now that I come to think of it, maybe we should have ploughed this way to begin with. You know, like just done the whole field this way. Wow, this seems kind of ridiculous start to this episode, but... It is what it is. I guess this is farming life sometimes. you just got to crack on with it. Sometimes you waste a little bit of time. Got another section of uh, what's left behind here. Some potatoes left behind. Get this ploughed up as well. We ourselves have missed some there. Okay, let's see how we've got on now. Okay, well that, that's, that's that bit sorted, but we've still got a little bit here. Um, I'm not going to worry too much about this, but I will just put the final sort of uh, touches on this. It's very strange this. I'd be interested to see how things grow on this, this uh, field once we've done this now. Right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to lay some seed on this field, um, the one that we've just finished off. Now, in order to do that, we will require our other tractor, which, if you remember last episode, is in here. Nicely tucked away with our brand new trailer that we bought for that mission that well wasn't really required, but certainly made life easier. What we'll do is detach the trailer and we will start to make our way over to the shop which is in this sort of direction if I remember rightly let's see how our work is getting on oh man look they've left it again okay hold on hold on let's see if we can set this guy going in the opposite the opposite way hey 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 stop 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 Okay, dismiss worker. There we go, right, okay. Right, let's see if we can plough it sideways on instead and see how that goes. Right, let's see if they'll finish this one for us now. Okay, they're cracking on. Um, I hope they don't sort of stop when they come to this part here. Hope they don't get confused and stop because that would be... Yep, that would be a bit of a nightmare really. Because it means that they'll come down there and then they'll uh, they'll stop and then we'll not have seen. So what we're going to do is we'll keep an eye on what they're doing actually. So I'll bring up the map and then we can see there um, in field 21... Our worker there is now return, like coming back down. What are they doing? They just sort of stopped. Oh no, there they are. I think they were just turning around. Right then, folks. So back in the vehicle. I've kind of decided what I'm going to do as far as the cedar goes. I'd have a little bit of a think about it because you can spend a fortune on um, items on this game at times and... They're not exactly going to be what you want. So what we're going to do is we're going to start off ba with basics. We're going to buy the the cheapest one, re really. The cheapest one which is available. The first one which is available. I've already picked up the seed. And I just wanted to explain. When it comes to the seed, you literally just buy one bag of seed. No matter what crop um, it is that you want to plant. You literally, it's only just one. There's one option to buy the seed. And then you, when you come to use the seeder... You then select the type of crop that you want to plant by using the seeder. So realism goes out the window a little bit there, but it is what it is. I mean, it's they're trying to keep it as, as fun as possible by doing that and not making it too complicated. And I understand that. So we've got a couple of bags of seed here. 
And as you can see, this field that we harvest previously in the other episode is now looking like it's growing back. So what we'll do is we'll just jump into the menu, um, like so. We'll go to the cedars, and we're just gonna. I think we're just gonna go with this first one here. We've got plenty of power, and we're gonna select, and we will buy. And we're now just gonna pick this one up, and this is the one that we'll use. We'll also load it up with the seed while we're here, and this seed can just stay here, really. I mean, we could bring it back to the farm, and we probably will do that at some point. But for now, oh man, come on, connect up. Okay, we're at the wrong side. That's fine. I wasn't too sure which side it would want us to connect this to. It's obviously this one. Right, so this one's on. What we'll do is we'll just reverse up to the seed now and get some in. Refill so, so we just click down on the left stick like so. And we'll do the same with this other one. Okay, there we go, so we're full now. So we'll now head back to our farm. And what we'll do, guys, once we get there, is we'll select the type of crop that we want to we wanna lay down, like I say. Uh, we'll also check on our worker and see how they're getting on and make sure they're still making some progress with that other field. Okay, so our worker's making good progress on this field. It looks like they're not having any issues, which is good. Um... What I'll do is I'll move down this end. So currently, I don't know whether you can see that, but next to the Y button it says there, select seed. We're currently on wheat. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll go with barley. We'll lower the sower and then we'll switch it on. Okay, so that's now a sowing seed like so. I don't know whether you can see that there. I'll we'll zoom in a bit. You see our sower's sort of working away at the back there. So that's pretty cool. So what we're going to do there, guys, we're going to hire a worker. Like that. And I'm going to jump out, get out the way. And then we'll take a look and see how that first line looks. Looks all right. Looks all right, doesn't it? Let's go. Let's take a look over here and see how see what's going on with this guy. Still glad to see this field's fertilized, 100%. So that's good. As time goes on, we will need to fertilize it some more but for now it's all right and this one's 100 percent fertilized although this one needs lime so there he goes plowing away doing a decent enough job i think it'll be something that we do next before we seed this one is to get the lime in there but guys that's it for this episode i really hope you've enjoyed this one if you have enjoyed, I'd really appreciate it if you would go ahead and subscribe. And if you've enjoyed the video, please do leave me, leave me a like. And let me know in the comment section what you want to see next. Do you want to see us buy some more fields? Um, should we do some more contracts? Let me know what you think, guys. And also let me know if you've played this game and if you're having a good time with it. Thanks so much for coming through, guys. And I'll catch you again soon.